From New York and on the new Hot 97 app, Ebro in the morning on Hot 97. Don't think of tonight. If you were like, hey, babe, you know, I know it's going to be cold, but let's just go out. We can always, we'll be in cars. If you're not driving yourself, if you're going to go out and expect Ubers, they're cracked. They're, yeah. No one Get wants to wait man. outside. So, And if you didn't shovel, guess what? Congratulations. You played After yourself. You worse, so and worse, and worse, and worse, and worse. You're playing yourself. You're playing yourself. You're playing yourself. I don't play. If you're out there driving fast and you don't think there's ice on the road because it's been plowed or something, guess what? Congratulations, you played yourself. Johnny, you said it's mad ice. Mad ice in the back streets of Brooklyn. I'm sure on every local block throughout the boroughs, it's just extremely slippery. You got to drive at least 10 miles an hour below what you normally drive. Juanito, you'd like to contribute here. Yeah, I played myself. Oh. Big time. All right, Juanito plays himself. How, sir? So when I was uh, moving stuff in my storage in the summer, I gave away all my Tims to the homeless. Like, whoever I saw on the street, I That's just gave That's nice. It to- right. Very nice. I just never bought Tim's again for the winter. Congratulations. You played yourself. And yesterday I messed up all the sneakers I wore yesterday in the snow. and So you don't have any, like, Nike ACG boots? Or you don't I give them all away. Give them all away. Any Columbia boots? Dude. Congratulations. You played yourself. I'm wearing uh, the, the tall Kobe's today. They're fine. Oh, that's a good call. They're not. They're not. They, I thought they might not be waterproof. No, no, no water gets through. The Kobe's are fine if you have the tall Kobe's. Because I don't have boots either. Shoot Congratulations. Time. You played yourself. Laura, what's on your list of people playing themselves today? Um, I just have one simple one, and it goes to me. <laughs> Congratulations. Yeah, like you played Everybody yourself. Played yesterday, himself. I sat here cracking up. Rosenberg, ha, 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 how he fell yesterday. Oh, well, it happened to me yesterday. So I'm going up the stairs from my building, right? <laughs> I finally make it to the top. I slip. But you, I grabbed the like the, the handle no, with one no, arm. You can't and, grab on. No. And not only did I fall on one knee, I tried Ooh. to get up and I swung around. No, so I no, landed no, up standing up no. and I'm just looking at everybody looking at me. People were there. Yes. Congratulations. You played yourself. And you know when people try to tell you, are you okay? I'm like, yeah, yeah, I'm fine. Guys, I had like this little tear in the corner of my <laughs> eye. Just Yo, trembling. the one small tear is my favorite. No. <laughs> Wait, why do you have one tear though? Because, because it hurt? Because it, hurt. <laughs> Cause it actually hurt. Oh, yeah. Laura, that's pathetic. <laughs> Shot a smile through. Congratulations, <laughs> you played yourself. One thug tear. <laughs> Hold it Trembling. up. Trembling. Rosenberg, who played yourself, or uh, themselves, or yourself, or what happened? Uh, I'll move quickly. Number one, uh, I played myself because I've been trying to get a hold of Drake. And it, the often hot and cold relationship that exists between two sensitive Jews we've documented on this show over years yes, yes, it's gotten yes. to the point now where I someone just wrote to me and said they were embarrassed for me because if you were to go to Drake's last Instagram picture of him trying to look all cool my comment pops up because I because if you follow me and it says me writing it publicly yes you're very handsome but can you respond to my DM now <laughs> Because oh oh I want to put on the record. Sometimes you got to put on the record. I pu- I want to say I publicly reached out to you, and you publicly shunned me because I'm trying to get a hold of him for something. So if I'm reaching out to you, you're asking Drake for something. You need him to do something for you. Well, I mean, it's not necessarily a for me. It was just a thought that I had. Just wanted to reach out to him and give him a thought. Just random thoughts. It's deep thoughts with Peter <laughs> Rosenberg and Drake. Okay, that's me. But then also, you see the story about Jacqueline Kent Cook? I don't know who that is. No. Well, Jack Kent Cook is the former owner of my Washington Redskins. He, okay. he died 12 years ago or something. His rich biatch daughter is 29 years old, which is crazy because he would be 104 right now. So he had her when he was like 75, 80 years old. Crazy. She was in court yesterday. Because uh, she's like some rich, you know, New York uh, socialite. And she got wasted on New Year's Eve. And outside of a restaurant, she was waiting to, like, get into an elevator or something. And a 77-year-old lady was taking too long. And she went, hurry up, Jew! And to put the icing on the cake, because she tried to deny saying anything anti-Semitic. So pardon me if I laugh. This is just too far. Her friend with her jumped in referring to the Jewish couple who was in front of them. Happy bat mitzvah. What? Were they, they were wasted, right? Yeah, they were wasted. There's video of them afterwards. So then they walk outside, and the man, I guess, who was with the 77-year-old woman thought better of it and was like, you know what? Nah. Went outside, went, excuse me, you can't say things like that to people. That's disgusting that you said that. You're a small-minded person. And she takes her purse, which is like made of like crystallized glass or something, 
hits the dude with the purse, busts his whole head open, uh, blood starts coming out. She falls down on the ground. This part's on video now, is yelling and flailing. Then they came to her and she had the nerve to say, no, I never even left my house on New Year's Eve. There's video <laughs> of you. Congratulations, wow. you played wow. yourself. And I don't care, but the story was amazing. Thank you, Rosemary. <laughs> no <problem. laughs> so all that big Willie talk, hop you up, playing yourself, y'all. Playing um. yourself, y'all. Playing yourself. Well, <laughs> I don't play. I saved these last two for the close. <laughs> Attorney General Sessions cracks down on weed. They're calling it war on marijuana. Wow. In 2018, if there are still people who think that voters between the ages of 8 and 7, 18 and 70, in Colorado, California, New Jersey, Washington, D.C., Washington State, Oregon, Massachusetts, Vermont. I'm trying to keep going. I think Florida has med medicinal now. Give a good goddamn about a federal government crackdown on weed. You can get weed everywhere, bro. Pretty much. I know 70-year-old people who use weed now instead of going and taking pills all the time. Cancer yeah. patients. Oh, I just know 70-year-old drug addicts who are using weed all the time, too. For sure. But there's 70-year-old drug addicts that are using legalized drugs. That's what I mean. I, yeah, absolutely. There are people who need it for help, and there are people who just... It's, it's a, this is over. This is the thing. My mother wants edibles. Yeah, oh, everyone's mom's wants Dead edibles. Ass, my mother wants some, like, Pain cookies. management, going just to yeah. sleep, epilepsy, or whatever. Again, I gave it to my mom, too. Or just getting appetite. twisted because I'm old. I was about to say, it's getting <laughs> twisted because you're old. That's the main part. <laughs> Attorney General Sessions in the federal government, the biggest. Congratulations, you played yourself. Everybody sees right through you. We know this is to, to, to support big pharmaceutical companies. Because we know the weed eats into their profits and you're already letting them slide with getting all these opioids and opiates on the street. We know this is to lock up poor kids who have little bags of weed on them so that you could fund these private prisons. Everyone sees right through it, fam. It's late for y'all. Seriously. It's way, way late.